getting an accurate interpretive diagnosis. Um, first factor is really the pathologists themselves. Um, their knowledge and their experience is probably the most critical thing in getting the diagnosis right. Um, beyond that, factor number two is clinical correlation, where they need to understand what the clinical question is and answer that question. Factor number three is using a standardized language so that everybody understands what they're talking about. Um, so that if someone makes a diagnosis in the US, you know, somebody in Japan can read it and understand what it is. And the college has done a tremendous job with the cancer protocols. I think that's really taught us that the power of standardization. Factor number four is the use of ancillary studies to confirm what we're seeing. Factor number five is having a second pathologist look at the material. Now, that's not done on every case, but I think most pathologists use that in some, to some extent to confirm what they're seeing. 